while in Houston, Texas, the first thing we want to check out is Houston Space Center. Parking here is $10. We are at the NASA Space Center in Houston. Looks pretty cool. Yeah. Good morning. Good morning. It's very big. Make sure to go to the information area to book tours such as the facility touring tour. Going to the tram tour, astronaut. This is the map for all the tour. There's a total of three of them. Two are free and the other one costs five dollars. And you will see a large white building. This building and the surrounding area become the George W.S. Abbey Rocket Park. This area was dedicated to George Abbey and take our astronauts to the moon. The rocket inside that building is the world's tallest, heaviest, and most powerful rocket in existence. Right now, teams are hard at work on the Artemis missions, which was sent the first American woman in person before it launched to make sure it could withstand super low temperatures. Cypher features Mars missions, which allows us to study human health performance and teamwork. Right there is the spaceship. Part of a rocket pod. Hey, this is uh, where they go to train. This is where our tax paying money go. SpaceX P17. With this technology, we can send astronauts into space more frequently than complete stop. Take in little ones by the hand and please make sure you watch your step as you exit on your right hand side only. I hope the rest of your time here at Space. Here's the food court, and next to it is the Gibson. But all you can eat so far away. Far away? Yeah. No. Nothing. It's in Go inside. Wash my head. Yeah, the simulation. Simulation. This is an extra right here. Which the only I rise ten dollar. That's the rise, and then the simulation is eight dollar. You can check out some show in the Destiny Theater. The show here are mostly educational. Around the area, there's a lot of artifacts and fun cool things to check out. It would take about an hour to an hour and 30 minutes just to go through this entire area.
you get to learn how astronauts live in space. These are called moon rock. I wonder why we never went back to the moon. Hopefully we can go to Mars in the upcoming year. For a $27 ticket, this museum was definitely more worth it than all the museums that we went to in America. You can book this through Caleb for a little bit of a discount. Rocket construction activity. Like of all the people. That's where you launch the rocket. Olympus. The outside area is also very educational. You can see a plane and also a space shuttle on top of it. A nice place for picturing too.
are those people named up there? This is a way of launching the space shuttle. You start with a flame first, and then the space shuttle eventually detached from the flame. This area light up at night during Christmas season. Too bad we don't have a lot of time to stay here. We got some souvenirs from the gift shop. It's like, I see this in the wing. And that concludes our trip. Bye everyone.